Lived in Central Texas the last decade plus, you've become used to the rocket testing or an engine tests that are going on at SpaceX. Well, today there were two very long, very loud tests that went on, and what they were doing is testing the Raptor engine. This is uh, one of the Raptor engines that they test. So they set the rocket or the engine horizontal to test the uh, strength and everything and make sure all it's working right. A lot of folks were worried what was going on today. Well, there's nothing different with this test. But there were some setups that made it a lot louder. Now they were long tests. The morning test went for five minutes and 13 seconds. The afternoon test just a little under five minutes, four minutes and 42 seconds. But what was different today? Why was it so loud? It was heard by areas a lot further away than typical. Here's the setup. So we had the cold front that moved through and brought the colder air with us. This is a graphic that you never see on TV. This is a graphic that shows us when we launch weather balloons, what the atmosphere is doing as you go higher up in the atmosphere. So what's important is this red line. It is showing how the temperature changes. You get higher up in the lowest level, level of the atmosphere, the troposphere. Typically that line goes down as it gets cooler as you get higher in the atmosphere. But you see this little nose right here. So that's what we call an inversion. That cold front came in. It pushed in colder, denser air down towards the ground. And we've got a layer of warm air that's sitting right above. Sometimes we see that on mornings when we have a lot of fog. Well, that inversion can hold the sound waves down at the ground. Typically, when you have one of these rocket tests, uh, the engine test, the sound can go all the way up into the atmosphere. We get a little bit of the rumbling and some of the noise, but today it was held down more so it could go further on the ground and be a lot louder. The interesting thing is, so these Raptor engines are for the SpaceX Starship. This is what it is here. It's launched down in Boca Chica. The crazy thing is, so they tested one engine, each one of these tests takes 33 of those Raptor engines is on that uh, Starship is it to get it up through the atmosphere. I can only imagine how loud it is down there when they test that. So we get a little of the science behind why it was so noisy and rumbly across many areas of Central Texas today.